All earthly things are perishable. Even the mountain that in its youth shot up from the sea and for so many symbolizes timelessness will one day turn to sand and disappear. Even the most beautiful and strongest of oaks will sway in the wind, and even that will someday bow to the ravages of time and eventually dissolve. Career, status, and all material things, things that we have fought for so long, will finally flow like sand through our fingers. The whole village fades away, family and friends who were our whole world follow the beat of the universe and constantly change form. We must protect the good, about family and friends and everything else we hold dear. But hand in hand, through our earthly journey there is someone who never leaves our side. It is the highest and greatest of relationships and someone who never lets us down. To some extent, we will always face trials, people will change, disappoint us or disappear but if we strengthen our relationship with our Creator, we will always feel held, receive comfort and guidance in whatever happens. At times we all lose ourselves in the fleeting, we cling to surface and form. It is valuable and nice to be able to feel grateful and enjoy the earthly, our relationships and everything that has been given to us here. But during this journey also putting energy and time into creating a deeper relationship with our higher power, our creator, the divine source is of such great importance. It gives us a deeper meaning, strengthens and keeps us upright on so many levels. I see so many who put all their focus on a specific human relationship, a certain job or a career step that should make them happy and satisfied. We have a tendency to try to maintain, fixate, and place far too much importance on all these external structures. There is nothing wrong with this and for many it happens naturally. But when the storm winds around the house, the electricity has gone out and I'm lying wide awake alone in my bed wouldn't it be nice to have established a strong connection to the soul and spirit? Enjoy life and all the good things in and around you, but also try to spend some time getting into a deeper connection with the Creator. The collective and the individual cannot defend themselves against the higher transformative energies that are constantly coming to us, all planets and forms of consciousness are all making a similar journey to expand. As we as the planet evolve and rise, the individual will also have to deal with healing new layers and things that have moved. This is why I want to emphasize the importance of having established a meaningful and beautiful relationship with the Source, God Father, or Mother or whatever we want to call it so that we feel that we are never really alone, that there is a loving higher power that holding and leading us forward. Thank you all for being there.